Driving through Brandon and Harrisburg, it's easy to see all the new development in both cities. And that means both the Brandon Valley and Harrisburg school districts will soon enroll even more students. But just how much they have grown might surprise you. Cabo Land's Dan Santella takes a closer look at the increases in tonight's Eye on Cabo Land. On the southern edge of Sioux Falls, the Harrisburg School District is known for being one of the fastest growing districts in the state. If you just go back to the early 2000s, 2000, 2001, we were at uh, an enrollment of about 750 some kids. And so to, to look at today being almost 5,200. The Brandon Valley School District on the eastern edge of Sioux Falls is seeing a similar trend. Superintendent Jared Larson says in fall of 2001, his district had 2,600 kids. Now that number is more than 4,400. We have experienced um, consistent and manageable growth over the course of uh, the last few years in our history, really. Um, last year, we had 197 uh, new students. Uh, this year, we experienced 177 additional students as far as enrollment growth goes. Another way is to look at the number of kindergartners and how that compares to the number of older students. Larson says graduating classes at Brandon Valley High School have around 250 students. We're bringing in about 350 kindergartners, between 350 and 375. So we see an automatic 100 um, additional students with our graduation versus incoming kindergarten students. Uh, that will level off as, um, as our graduating classes get a little bit larger, uh, but we do anticipate and plan that our growth will continue. Harrisburg is also trying to accommodate more high school grads. Our current high school has almost 1,200 students in it and the capacity, we've really reached the capacity uh, from a building standpoint, and that's the reason for the addition to the high school now. Because our kindergarten class is so much larger than our older grades, so we have 478 kindergartners currently, kindergartners currently, uh, we are going to see so much growth in the high school level that we will outgrow even with the addition in about three years. To keep up with the growth, both school districts are planning expansions. Right now in the Brandon Valley School District, we are in the process of construction planning for an elementary school located on 41st Street in Sparta. We're building a seventh elementary right now. Uh, we also have a, a freshman academy that's under construction, uh, planned to be open by August of 2020. Graf says the academy refers to where the students will be in the building. There's also expansion on the horizon at Brandon Valley High School. The Brandon Valley High School will get an addition um, in, in, the, in the future. I would say we're probably three years out from, um, from an addition at the Brandon Valley High School, three to five years out. Um, some of that depends a little bit on, uh, on how enrollment um, continues to grow. Graf says the Harrisburg School District also has to take into account the expansion of Sioux Falls as he looks at expected enrollment growth in his district. I think we really anticipate that just because of the growth of the Sioux Falls area and about you know half of our buildings are in the uh, city limits of Sioux Falls. Because ultimately rooftops drive student growth. At the end of the day where the houses are going and the rooftops are going, that's where the schools need to go because uh, because the kiddos need to learn. Chin. Everyone say it. Chin. Good, Violet. How about you? With Eye on Kelloland, I'm Dan Centella. The Sioux Falls School District is also dealing with crowded schools. It's in the process of building a new high school and middle school. They should be ready for students by the fall of 2021.